Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm doing this really pretty quick and simple summer look. I thought as we're now heading into June and into summer, I would start some summery looks. So this is um, a look that I've been wearing quite a bit recently and it's just really simple, really pretty and you can get away with it like as an everyday look if you wanted to. So first of all, as always, I'm going to prep my skin and for this I'm taking the L'Oreal Lumi Magique Primer just to really moisturise up my skin and just create a really dewy finish to the makeup which I think is just perfect for summertime. Then for foundation I'm using my Revlon Colorstay foundation in the shade Buff and I'm mixing this with the Topshop Liquid Illuminator. Illuminator? Yeah. And this will just create a really pretty highlight under the foundation just to really give the skin that glowing effect which is just again perfect for summer. And to blend this all out I'm using a damp beauty blender as always. I'm using two concealers for this look. The first one is the Barry M, I think this is the Reflector Concealer, one of the new ones they brought out. This is in the fair shade they have. I'm using this as a highlight for under my eyes. Then I also will be taking the MUA Cover and Conceal Concealer, again in the lighter shade, for any, to cover any blemishes that I have. And again, I'm just going to take my dark beauty blender just to blend it all out. Just to set the concealer under my eyes and just to stop any oilness down my T-zone, I'm just taking the Maybelline Matte Maker Mattifying Powder. And this is in the shade Classic Ivory, just to set the concealer and just to prevent any unnecessary shine on the face. Then moving on to eyes, I'm taking the Max Factor Excess Shimmer in the shade Copper. It's a really nice creamy, moussey texture type shadow and I'm just putting this all over the lid and it just, it's so pretty. You can use it by itself like I'm going to now and it does set dry which I really like and it just stay put all day long. Then for mascara, I'm just taking this one from Sleek. Uh, I'm not entirely sure which mascara it is, but I will link that down below as always. For bronzer, I'm actually taking a foundation from Sleek and it's a cream to powder foundation they do. But obviously as you can see this is a shade, colour shades darker than my skin, it's in the shade Bamboo. And I find this is really nice just to create a really natural bronze look to the face. It's Like I said, it's cream to powder so it'll give a quite a natural finish. I'm just applying this with a big fluffy brush. I don't want any contour, I literally just want to bronze up the face and I just really love using it, this for that. For blusher, I'm taking um, the L'Oreal Le Blush, and this is in the shade Peach, and this just complements the bronzer really well, I think, and I just think it's a really perfect shade for summer. Mm -hmm. 
I won't be adding any highlighter to this look today just because that original Topshop Illuminator creates a really nice natural highlight underneath so the highlighter is not necessary. Then the final thing I'm going to do is put some of the Revlon Colour Burst Matte Balm in the shade Audacious. This is really nice. It's not In real life it's much brighter than it's coming off on camera but it's a really nice matte bright orange which is just a perfect shade for summer and I really like it because of course it's matte and it'll stay all day long. So I really hope you enjoy this look. Like I said it's very quick and simple and it's just so pretty for summer like an everyday summer look. So I hope you like this. Please give it a thumbs up if you do and subscribe if you're not and I'll see you in the next video.